Hey everyone, it's me Daisy and welcome to my channel. If you've ever been to Hong Kong, you will know this is a very popular bread. It's called a pineapple bread or the locals call it polapau because of how the top looks kind of like a pineapple. If you've never tried it, you're in for a trip. Most people don't think you can make this at home. I'm going to show you how you can make it and enjoy it anywhere you are. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started! And here are the ingredients that we need for the filling. We need 125 grams cake flour, 90 grams castor sugar, 50 grams butter softened, 15 grams milk powder, 1 egg yolk, 1 tablespoon milk, 1 4 teaspoon baking soda, and 1 4 teaspoon baking powder. And for the dough, we need 360 grams bread flour, 70 grams granulated sugar, 1 half teaspoon salt, 7 grams instant dried yeast, 120 grams milk, 1 large egg, 120 grams tangzong, and 30 grams unsalted butter softened. To start, we'll make the filling first. In a big bowl, combine butter and sugar. Mix until combined. Then, add cake flour and milk powder. Stir to combine. Then, add milk and egg yolk and stir. Lastly, add baking soda and baking powder and stir to combine until you form a dough. Transfer to a clean surface and form into a roll. Wrap with plastic and chill for at least 2 hours or until the dough is ready. And to make the dough, in another big bowl, add milk and tangzong and mix to combine. Next, add sugar and salt and stir. Then add egg and stir to combine. Lastly, add flour and yeast. Mixed until incorporated. Transfer to a floured surface, 
knead for about one minute. And then add butter. Oh guys, just be ready. This is the messy part after adding the butter. Just keep kneading until you get the smooth consistency. About 8 minutes. Transfer to a lightly greased bowl. Cover and let it rest for one hour. After the dough has risen, pinch it to release the air. Transfer to a lightly floured surface. and divide into nine equal parts. Roll each dough into a small bowl. Do the same with the rest. Cover and let it rest for 15 minutes. Turn the dough. And shape again into a small ball. And press flat. Transfer to a tray lined with parchment paper. Do the same with the rest. Cover and let it rest for 45 minutes. Take the filling from the fridge and divide it into 9 parts. Brush all the dough with egg wash before putting the filling on top of the dough. Using a rolling pin, flatten the filling just enough to cover the bread dough. Place filling on top.
Repeat the same procedure with the rest. Now that all the dough is topped with the filling, brush it with the egg wash. Bake it in a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 18 minutes or until golden brown. Remove and serve while it's hot. And enjoy! I hope you enjoy watching the video and if you like it, please give a thumbs up, write a comment below, share it with your friends, and subscribe if you haven't. Thank you!